your guide to constellations, deep sky objects, planets, and events. Tonight's sky, highlights of the September sky. Just after sunset, Mars and Saturn appear low in the southwestern sky. Use a telescope to get a better view of the planets before they set. September nights feature the wet quarter of the sky. Two neighboring constellations bear ancient references to water. Aquarius is one of the oldest constellations, recognized even by early civilizations. In ancient mythologies, Aquarius is the god of the waters. Look for the water jar, a group of stars shaped like a Y. A rich, compact cluster of stars can be seen in Aquarius. Known as M2, it contains about 150,000 stars located about 37,500 light years away. Binoculars present it well, but a small telescope reveals much more detail in the cluster's compact center. Nearby lies the great constellation Capricornus, known in mythology as the water goat. It represents a creature that fed and watered the infant Zeus, ruler of the Greek gods. Algeti is the brightest star in Capricornus. It's visible in binoculars as an elongated star. This odd shape is due to a visual trick. From our distant vantage point, two unrelated stars appear to be close together. Capricornus also hosts a dense cluster of stars, M30. A small telescope easily resolves individual stars in the cluster. Majestic Jupiter graces the early morning sky before sunrise. A telescope reveals the planet's dark bands. This month's full moon is known as the Harvest Moon. It rises in the east before the end of twilight on September 8th. The added bright moonlight lengthens the evening to give farmers extra time to harvest their crops. The night sky is always a celestial showcase. Explore its wonders from your own backyard. <laughs>